Time now for the weather with Gillian. Um, this time last week we were looking at a, a weather warning. How is this weekend shaping up? I know it's been a month of contrast, mm. hasn't it? And there's more change on the way because it has been so cold, turning much milder over the weekend, Laura, but a bit more unsettled <laughs> with some rain mm. at times. Good evening to you. It was very cold today. Some parts didn't get above freezing at all. But there's a change on the way and it's because we have low pressure moving in. It's associated weather fronts bringing out breaks of rain. And you can see from the chart, milder air caught up with that. Tonight, some of that rain will be persistent, some of it will be heavy. By morning, it becomes increasingly confined to the Western and Northern Isles and the Northwest Highlands. And elsewhere, we'll see some drier conditions developing. Still, fair bit of cloud. The lowest temperatures will be during the first part of the night. They will recover quite well by morning, up to six or seven Celsius for most of us as we introduce that milder air. But it will be breezy, especially along the West Coast and over the Northern Isles. Tomorrow, we start with rain in the North and northwest and then into the afternoon we see another batch of it moving into western Scotland. There'll be some drier spells but I think by around three o'clock quite heavy rain for Shetland. Some drier conditions towards the Murray coast over northern Aberdeenshire and in towards Fife, the Lothians and the borders as well a wee bit of brightness and you can see the difference in those temperatures 10, 11, 12 Celsius well up on what we saw today but further west thicker cloud outbreaks of rain persistent and heavy at times for the Western Isles, the Northwest Highlands, parts of Argyll and South West Scotland, all accompanied by those brisk south to south westerly winds. Not much changes tomorrow evening. We hang on to lots of cloud, further spells of rain working their way northeastwards across the country and we'll still have those brisk winds. So that's how we start the weekend with low pressure in charge. For Saturday, you can see still a fair few isobars on that chart. It will be blustery. We'll have a good deal of cloud. We'll have some bits and pieces of patchy rain, some brighter spells, especially in the northeast. And once again, it's mild temperatures in the teens for some of us. For Sunday, we start with rain. That clears away to leave brighter skies for many, but we have some heavy showers following into the northwest. Temperature-wise, again, it's mild, but it's turning chillier again into next week. So a colder start to December, Laura. Okay, Gillian, thank you very much indeed. Right, let's.